Hey what's up guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video I will show you how to fix black screen in your RPC S3 and how to fix black screen with sound in your RPC S3. Let's get started. First of all guys go to configuration and go to CPU. And, uh, you have to uh, select from here recompiler LLVM and uh, select from here enable uh, SPU loop detection so I have already selected and select from here save and select from here one and go to GPU so it's very important thing over here so some games workable with a Vulkan and some games workable with uh, OpenGL so you can try both options but I recommend Vulkan and if you want to use Vulkan, then disable this one, Texture Streaming. So uncheck it and uh, check this option. It's very important, guys. Right color buffer. If you want to play Demon Soul uh, in your RPC S3 without black screen, then check this option. And if you want to use Vulkan with your GPU device, then make sure you have already installed latest region drivers for your GPU so go to search bar on your windows and type here device manager so I go to my device manager now go to display adapter and go to your uh, GPU device right click and go to properties and drivers so make sure you are using latest region drivers and driver date so I am using older version drivers so I need to update my driver's version for my GPU. The older version drivers are main reason of black screen in RPC S3. So update your drivers first for your GPU. So I close it and select from here uh, this one 16 by 9 and select from here off uh, frame limit select auto and high air quality and default resolution so you need to select from here recommended not use any other resolution if you use any other uh, resolution scale then you can face black screen with sound uh, with your game in your RPC S2 so select this one now click on apply and save so after these settings you can fix black screen in your RPC S3 for your games and make sure you have all folders for your game so I have a game in folder format as you can see so for example I cut it and I paste here so if you want to play this game uh, without this folder then you can face black screen in your RPC S3 so use all folders for your games and I paste here and now I close it and I have another uh, solution uh, of this problem if you are using older region uh, RPC S3 then please update your RPC S3 now as you can see update available so click on yes if you want to play new games in your RPC S3 then you need newer version RPC S3 but fix black screen okay so click on yes and wait for some time Now uh, update successful and ok. Now my RPC S3 is up to date. And after updating if you face a crashing problem or black screen uh, then uh, go to your uh, RPC S3 and right click open file location and uh, over here uh, delete this folder from here big flash and delete it and reopen your RPC S3 now after uh, reopening your RPC S3 you need to install your firmware files oh, I played the game but I need to install my firmware files as you can see so install your firmware files and uh, after installing your latest version firmware files you can fix the black screen problem for your RPC S3 so hope this tutorial will be helpful for you guys if you like then please subscribe thanks for watching guys